What I, the one thing I said to Kelly and Adam, I said, and I've always vouched by this, I don't want to fight bums and I don't want to pad my record. Um, and I believe I've proven that in my last four fights. I've always, I fought whoever was at the top at the time. Um, where they are now, who knows? But at the time, we always took the hardest fight. I, I said once I come back from my recovery and my rehab from my shoulder, uh, Tyson Pedro was a great fight. Um, because although he was an up and comer and had a, a smaller record than me, uh, I, I knew he's got talent, Let, let's not face it, I knew it would be a blockbuster fight. Uh, the way we'd fight, the, the crowd support, the two gyms going head to head, it would have been, it would have been spectacular. It probably honestly would have gone down as one of the best fights in, in uh, Australian history in MMA. That fight's gone, so that's fine. But I said to Kelly and Adam, I go, I need a fight that is going to motivate me and I need a fight that I'm not going backwards on. Um, there's not a lot of light heavyweights building up the ranks. There's a few good guys coming up, but they're in their own little circle fighting each other. I feel like my generation's either retired or they've moved on to the UFC. So because of this injury, it's put me out a year, a year and a half, I've, I'm finding my place. And I believe that I'm above that level and I want to fight international. Now it doesn't have to be UFC, and I know coming off a loss and the drop to middleweight, I've still got to prove that I'm the best light heavyweight. And, and as much as it kills me to say it, I've got to prove it again. Um, I'm more than happy to do it. And then that, that fight came up for China AFC. I was trying to get healthy enough to fight on that show. Shoulder just wasn't there yet. Um, but yeah, they put Soccer Drew versus Marcelo and poof, you can't complain. Whoever it is, good luck to you. That's all I want to say. Marcelo, from what I know, is a BJJ guy uh, with something like 70-odd Muay Thai fights. Don't know how you're a BJJ guy when you've had that many kickboxing fights, but that's great. Um, and everyone knows Sokoju. Pride, Strike Force, UFC, Bellator, knocking out Big Nog. Uh, so props to them. I, I'm, I read the articles, obviously, because I got tagged in them. Uh, Marcelo was just doing the typical, I'm a light heavyweight. I'm going to win this fight and then I'm going to challenge the light heavyweight. Uh, but he was respectful. Uh, then Soccer Juice 1 came out. And it was something along the lines like, of course I will win, I will destroy him and take that belt. Well, give me one second. Hey Soccer Juice, how are you? My name's Jamie. I would just like to say that you better do your job, come China. Send Marcelo back to Brazil, like you said, and then I'm more than happy to show you that you ain't gonna destroy shit. Cheers.